you do understand when you're an athlete is that in order to go from being okay to, to being really good, it takes a lot of practice and a lot of work and it just doesn't happen by snapping your fingers. The secret to my success, I was blessed with a lot of physical talent. I grew up in the game, which gave me an advantage to understand the game a little bit. But in the end, it's gotta come from within inside you. I loved every minute of it. I loved to practice, I loved to work, work out. So I think the secret would be love what you do. It's all in the people. Uh, many times in baseball, you're taking a lot of raw talents and you're piecing them together. All different backgrounds, all different areas. They can throw, they can hit, they can run. And then you try to merge those together in a philosophy of, uh, of team unity and winning. And we used to call that chemistry. Building a business, the word is more building a culture. And so finding the right people, finding the right like-minded people, finding the ones that want to work, uh, that can be self-motivated, that will work in the business world just like it works in the baseball world. My dad was uh, someone that didn't openly express that um, I love you. Um, it was, he was an older school, but he demonstrated and showed us in many different ways that we knew. My first major league home run, my dad was the third base coach, and dad would shake everybody's hand uh, on a home run around third base. But I could tell it was different for me. You know, it was him telling me he loved me at that moment. It's normal to have low points um, in your career. Baseball is a game of frustration and failure in many ways. As a hitter, you fail seven out of 10 times. So you have to figure out how to deal with failure quite a bit. And that's one of the keys to having longer term success. I think at the middle of my career, we were in a major rebuilding situation. I didn't know the direction of the team. Uh, I felt like I couldn't hit anymore. You know, I couldn't concentrate, I couldn't physically hit. And I was wondering if this was the end sort of thing. I had to dig down and kind of start over, go back to some of the basics of hitting and start to learning how to hit all over again. And so I worked through them and, and made it back. I'd like to, uh, to have a bigger impact in youth baseball. I'd like to grow the game of baseball with Major League Baseball, try to tell you all the beautiful things that are in the game. It's not a slow, boring game. There's a lot going on. To understand that is that you have to really start to teach the game. Hey YouTubers, are you looking to land your dream gig or start your own business? Well, you found the right place. You can learn from fellow entrepreneurs and peers that are embarking on their own journeys. Subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me or the I right here to join CNBC on the journey to make it. We're going to motivate and inspire you, but you'll have to bring the fire.